the channel. It's your boy Cardi Five coming in with another video. So we out of Dallas, Texas. So whoo, it's hot today. So about 10, 101, probably 102. But anyway, so uh, a quick update on the 50. So uh, I was out doing some testing before I was getting ready to go to the track on Sunday, which I didn't get to go because. Something happened in the rear. Uh, before anybody starts saying uh, anything, uh, I have full BMR suspension with a one-piece uh, aluminum dry shaft from Dry Shaft Shop on BMR drag springs. And so, what I'm gonna do is get the car in the in the garage, get it jacked up, and show y'all. Uh, what happened? So I want uh, I run the urethane poly uh, BMR bushings for the diff and the cradle. So uh, one of the one of the bushings for the uh, for the diff. I'm not sure if the boat bent or the uh, urethane bushing. Uh, went bad underneath and guys I do dig this car I don't do too much road racing so uh, it is a manual car six speed so but yeah so we're gonna go ahead and get it in the garage get it jacked up and uh, let's get a cold start hasn't been running in a minute so y'all guys new to the channel hit that subscribe button like this video share it and feel free to leave me a comment you know let me know what you want to see you want to see uh a draggy 40 to once 40 to 140 60 to 130 y'all just let me know uh haven't really done a draggy on the car but uh let's go ahead and start this up because it's hot as hell As you can see, it's on heat. We ain't talking about E85, we talking about almost out of gas. get this bad boy jacked up so give me a second to get it jacked up and i get back with y'all guys all right guys got the car jacked up and we're gonna look at these bushings real quick and as you can see this one and probably can't see the top but i have plenty space at the top and the bottom of this right here compared to that one this one is a little bit down so and I have a lot of space up here so what I'm probably gonna do off camera is check this bolt because this runs all the way through back here. So it'll be a challenge trying to film that for y'all and get the boat out of there so I can check this year thing, poly bushing. And this is not a, a, a insert that you just put in there on top of your regular 
stock bushing. You no, know, all this was cut out, and I put these in there. Didn't go with the solid ones due to the noise, but if it is a problem with these, uh, most likely I'll probably have to pull the dip out and get these out and put the new ones, new ones in, and to show you what what I mean by all the way through. So as you can see. Right here, it's kind of dark. That's had to be drilled all the way out. And then lock nut and washer and little sleeve. And this comes with upgraded uh, hardware over the factory. So this is always good. And like I said, VMR braces, tie rods, GT350 axles, upper camera arm with the lockout plate, and I still have stock sway bar and the stock shock on here. That's pretty much that I have stock on the rear. Everything else has been pretty much touched. So, if y'all guys looking into being more products, I'm gonna have to say yes, they are good products. Theta has some good products, but depending on what your attentions are with the vehicle, as far as uh, road coursing and racing, you know, pretty much just try to figure out what's your preference and what you're gonna do with the car, so that way uh, you know what stuff you want to put on, so that just throwing any kind of product on you know do your research uh, so far all this stuff has improved you know have the front uh, traction brakes on the front and like I said the one piece drive shaft so and this car comes with 355 gears I, I plan on changing uh, to 373s just for uh, you know, longer, longer shifts, you know, till I decide to go boost it. But I'll keep this dip as well and play around with both of them just to kind of figure out, you know, which one does better out the hole. But yeah, that's pretty much it, y'all. Uh, and again, if y'all new to my channel, like, subscribe and support your boys free to subscribe and stay tuned for the next video and then i'll give y'all update of what y'all what i find and i'll let y'all know and fill y'all in on the details all right y'all stay uh hydrated stay tuned for the next video later <laughs>